case 26. I'll just tell you guys, I'm sorry for rushing through these. These poor cases that are like case 20 through 30 always get the, the, the short end of the stick. So at first you could think of like a PG, but it's spindly here. And the spindle cells are running in fascicles, hyperchromatic, plump, scattered mitoses, but not usually pleomorphic. So I feel like this is a tumor that if you see it, you'll be like, it's atypical, but I'm not totally sure if it's malignant or not. And this is kind of a dark, darkly stained slide. But uh, these areas here, you'll find little slit-like spaces with blood in between. It's kind of out of focus there. Here we go. Slit-like spaces with blood and fascicles of somewhat atypical, but not wildly pleomorphic usually. Spindle cells, think about Kaposi sarcoma. So this is the kind of the nodular stage or tumor type stage of Kaposi sarcoma. And then when you cut those fascicles in cross section, they have little holes with blood in them. So people often focus on the slit like spaces, but I think the little holes are, are actually good too. And my mentor, Mark Edgar said, this is like the sieve or colander kind of pattern, like the spaghetti strainer pattern, where each little hole is filled with blood. And there will usually be plasma cells. And then if you have any doubt, you can do the uh, HHV8 um, stain, which is a really nice stain that's very sensitive and specific to confirm the diagnosis. So this is tumor stage capacity, and I have a long video about capacity. I'll put a link to it down below.